Hello there. How are we this morning? All right. Just out on a little walk. Sat at home this morning. Uh, I put my computer on and uh, there was old Chris Packham talking passionately about hen harriers he was. Apparently it's uh, hen harrier day today. The seventh national hen harrier day. And I thought, what am I doing sitting here when I could be out on the moors? Hen harrier country. See if I can spot any hen harriers. So that's what I'm doing today. What do we know about hen harriers? Wow. The old landowners around here don't like them, do they? Those fat, money, money bloody people, you know. Uh, they organise their grouse shoots, don't they? And make money out of it. Make money out of killing. Horrible bastards. Yeah. Uh, and this is what they do around here. The hen harriers come along, eat the baby grouse. So these people shoot them. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I was watching Chris Packham talk, talk about it and I thought, get yourself out there. I was up there, Britland Edge Hill the other day. And I saw what I think was a hen harrier. Uh, what do we know about them? The males are smaller than the females. Males are a grey colour with black tips to their wings. Females, well, they're a lot, lot bigger. Yeah, uh, brown. Got a ring on the tail, ring tails they call them. Uh, they're fantastic flyers. Yeah, they do a thing called the sky dance. The male does when he's trying to impress the females. Where he swoops around and it's fantastic. They also do this thing where they uh, pass the food in flight. The male passes the food to the female, which is quite a spectacle. It's something I've never seen. Yes, yeah, so as I say, I thought I saw one up on Snailston the other day. I flew from Snailston over to Ramsden Clough, onto the crags there. Uh, but now I'm doubting that it was a hen harrier. I just spoke to some cyclists uh, and they say that bloody vulture's still about. They saw it the other day on the crags up here on the northern side of Bleaklow. So I thought it had gone. I hadn't heard nothing about it for weeks. The old European bearded vulture. Yeah. But you never know, you might see a hen harrier. Look at this, look, isn't this gorgeous? Britland Edge Hill there. Dew Hill Maze. Tooley Shore Moss. And West End Moss. Looking down here to uh, Longdendale. Queues of traffic along there. I'm guessing there's some roadworks or something going on there. So, we're out hen hunting, hen harrier hunting. Fingers crossed, eh? You never know, you might see one. Uh, also, I'm off over here. There's some beautiful waterfalls on the other side of the valley there. I'm going to go and see if I can get some photographs of them. So that's the plan for today. Wonderful, very warm today. Yeah, waterfalls are in them woods over there. I don't know if you can see it. I'm looking straight into the sun here. Might not be able to see much of that. Yeah, watching old Chrissy Packham, he's a great bloke, isn't he? I uh, really like the bloke very passionate about what he talks about, you know. 
hen harriers are a big fashion of his. So I thought, get yourself out there. Jumped in the car, bit of Bruce Springsteen on the CD player, and off we went. An hour later, I'm out here. Could have been sitting at home now, can I? <laughs> Never mind. The dark peak, they call it. Hardly what you call dark, is it? Don't get me wrong, it can be dark around here. Dark and moody. Not today though. We're actually on the Trans Pennine Trail at the moment, coming down to the Woodhead Pass Road. We've got to cross over this road and head up to them woods. Busy road this. Main road through the hills between Manchester and Barnsley. Pippets. Lots of pippets. No hen harriers yet, as yet. Right, after these waterfalls, I might go up onto Bleak Low. Up to uh, Grinnerstones and Barrowstones. Pick up a path that goes back to the uh, Shepherd's Meeting Stones. And then drop down to the road at Windle Edge which is where I'm parked up today. Might do that, might not. I've only got a few hours. Got to pick the wife up from work at five o'clock. Must be about half 12 now. So I've got a few hours. A few hours of play time. A few hours of me time do what I want to do. Told you it was a busy road. Headed up there. If I see a grouse butt today, I'm going to piss in it. How's that? 